So if we look here and we see an explanation, um, we see that the rotation of the moon is locked by the gravity to the Earth, so it is showing the same face all the time. And here we see a counterclockwise rotation. Just note the rabbit ears. You can see the rabbit in the moon. Just watch the rotation of that as it goes counterclockwise. Now watch this. All right, so here we see a rotation of the moon counterclockwise. And here we see the rabbit ears going around and around in this time-lapse photography of the moon, allegedly. Yet we scroll down here and we see a time-lapse over 28 days of the phases of the moon. And look at the left over here. And here we see the moon not rotating one iota. Here's the rabbit ears. Here's the rabbit ears. Here's the phases of the moon. So this is over 28 days, and we see zero rotation of the moon. Folks, and if that isn't enough, let's click over to here and show you another version of as the moon turns or doesn't move, that the face is always facing us, all right? So here's moon phases for 2013, and we're going to set this in motion. And we're going to watch the moon rotate counterclockwise. Yeah, oh, wait, what did it do? It started going the other way. Now here's the new moon. Here's coming up the quarter moon, silvery moon, the half moon. It's rotating. And then all of a sudden, watch what happens. It stops one way and starts reversing clockwise. Here we see a full moon going to a three-quarter moon, going to a half moon. <laughs> wait, now it's going back the other way, folks. Boy, I tell you, they just can't make up their mind trying to lie to us to tell us what story to believe about which way the moon is rotating so that we can always see its face. 